Bass, what's wrong? Why are you down? I mean, drama season's over. Sports season is over. It's like there's nothing to do. And I even went and tried to be Mr. Reed's body double. That didn't even work out. Heck, I didn't even dress the part. And then I'm too tall. So now it's like, there's nothing. We got nothing. I do not care how many state titles you have. Oh, okay. I am still the better right, anchor. You know, oh, I'm JC Wilson. Good morning, Choctaw High School. I'm going to stare directly at the camera and not use any vocal inflection. You know what? Hey, okay. Jeff, hey. Michelle, get all of you guys. I need you on my side. I am done with you. It's oh, yeah? happening now. Uh -huh. We are done. Okay, at least me, Morgan, Melissa, and Ollie do the work around here. You guys are all sitting around listening to freaking musicals all day. Okay, I'm not going to argue that because Shrek the Musical was fantastic. But do not jump on me for... Pursuing what I love, and I love this class, and I'm not gonna let you ruin it! So come uh -huh. on, now, yeah. come sure. on! Alyssa! Ali! Let's go! Come on! Uh, oh, uh, don't go uh, with uh, her! Uh, too bad, he doesn't have a voice. Sorry, I see dude. how it is, Ali. Sorry, Bruno. Okay, no, no, take your time. Yeah, I got an idea. Instead of arguing about it, we can have a competition. Have a shanker off. That's it. Brilliant! You've done it again, Crowder! Here we are, back in the big town, and it's time once again for the toughest game in town. Yes, this competition has been running since 1927, the year the TV was invented. That's right, and this year it's in color. <laughs> you are correct, sir. So for 92 years, these kids have been coming in every year, gutting it out, giving everything they got, and uh, this is a heck of a fun time. Well, right now we're going to go down live with our reporter on the sidelines, Brisa and Tiriano. She's going to take it away with the gold team. I told you that the left side is my best side. Why can't you get it right? You can never get it right. Risa, take it away. Yes, Mr. Crowder. Thank you so much. The team gold is coached by Jason Burning Man Burnham, Michelle Maniac Hampton, Kaylee Spicer Dicer, and Jeff. The team is super set and smooth by Landon, Izzy, Bella, Christian, Liz, Tyler, and Casey. They have been hard at work, and let's take a look to see what they've prepared for this competition. Man, those guys look tough. They're going to be hard to beat this year. I think uh, the blue team's going to have their hands full, but let's take a look. Hunter Reed, tell us who we got on the blue team. Take it away. Yes, blue team is literally foaming at the mouth in anticipation. And let's introduce them. Their head coach, J.C. Castaway Wilson, Prince Ali Fabulous Higadiaga, Morgan Light Bright, and Alyssa the Missile Farmer. Their team is well-rounded and will make them a favorite heading into the final leg of the competition. And here they are, CJ, Lexi, Sabra, Carson, Sarah, Eston, Eric, and Allison.
I think it's anybody's game going in. And this is truly set up to be the best competition in decades. Ooh, uh, you are absolutely right, my friend. I can't wait to see this unfold. And we're going to get the Battle of the Titans going here. And uh, Breeze is going to take us to the first competition, Anchoring. All right. Now remember, look at the camera, smile, look at the cue cards if you need to. And just keep a positive attitude. We're going to keep a good energy around here. Okay, is that totally fine? Is that good? Yes. Yeah. Yeah. All right, yeah. we're good. We're good. Let's get this, people. Looks like Prince Ali Fabulous He Gaiaga is getting his team ready to roll the magic carpet out for victory. Let's see if he can give some insight to the mindset of the anchor. Yes, first and foremost, you have to have that perfect smile. Then turn that smile into a confidence to articulate your voice and deliver what's on the teleprompter. And there you have it, guys, from the legendary anchor himself. Now we're set. Let's see how Carson and Allison do on this one. The McRib's Dude. back? What? No, it says something about dinosaurs. Can y'all flip the car? Yeah, I can't, I can't okay. see. Wow. I have no words. Hey! Are they done yet? They, they lost me at hello. <sighs> Let's see if Jason's team can keep me awake for once. I have a girlfriend. Oh, and we're back with Jason the Burning Man Burnham to catch up with his strategy with his team. All right, guys, this is the first round of the competition, so just keep your heads in the game, all right? I trust you. You can do this. Just please don't fail me, all right? Let's go. Come on. So what's the strategy here? Project! Project! And they can't close their eyes. I've super glued them open. Well, that's one way to do it. Hello, Choctaw High School. I'm Landon Rhodes. And I'm Isabel Baker. And we wanted to talk to you about graduation. Seniors, graduation rehearsal will be held May 13th at the Fire Lake Arena. If you are a speaker or singer, you need to arrive at 8 a.m. and all other seniors need to arrive at 9. Later that night, graduation will be held at 7 p.m. and all seniors need to arrive at 5.30. Gowns are required, but jeans or shorts will not be allowed. Please wear nice shoes, no cowboy boots or sneakers, and your graduation cap will be provided. Thank you, Izzy. Baccalaureate will be held May 12th, which is coming up very fast, so please turn in all forms and paperwork by May 12th. Thank you, seniors. That's it for today. Have a great day, Talk to High School. Well, that's definitely not horrible. Oh, I think Jason, uh, the Burnham man, Burnham, had his, his team ready to go. They were prepped, uh, looked energetic, and I think they're going to be tough to beat. Well, now, now we'll go over and see how they will call a live game. Over to Hunter Reed and time for some play-by-play. -play. Uh, it might be my favorite competition. Philosophy is a battle against the bewitchment of our intelligence by means of language. So let's see who comes out on top. And John Whitland one more time set. Now here comes the 2-2 pitch to Edgar Martinez. Fastball swung down the middle of the deep center field. And Bernie Whedon goes back to get it. And get out the right, Brad, and the mustard this time. Grandma, it is a grand salami. And the Mariners lead it 10-6. I don't believe it. My own. That was absolutely brilliant. That was the greatest call I've heard since David Niehaus. <laughs> oh, no doubt. Holy cow. Well, let's see if the next team can top that. Breeza. Breeza. Oh, here we go. If music be the food of love, play on. Hmm. Why did the ball hit the ground? Well, I'm, I'm not quite sure. I did think that was allowed in this game. Is this baseball? Well, apparently it's like cricket or something. But in all honesty, I thought cricket was that one like phone company or something. Is it not a phone company? <laughs> well, I'm not quite sure anymore. Huh. Having to call cricket was definitely a sticky wicket.
I don't think they knew the difference between a googly and a corker. Yeah, and I thought everybody knew that. We went over that clearly in Cricket 101. It was our best lesson all year. Yeah, no doubt. (laughs) Well, it's all tied up. And it's come down to the time where we're going to see who wants to take all the marbles. Yep. Big cheese. Top dogs. Who is going to take the cake? And it all boils down to who can set up for the live stream the fastest. Well, it's all tied up going into the final match. I caught up with the blue team's coaches to see how they prepare their team for this event. So what do you think will be the key to this event? It's all about that Cracker Jack timing speed and the calm, cool head of a champion to not fold under pressure. Let's check in with Breeze to see how Team Black prepare for this one. Thanks, Hunter. I'm here with Kaylee and Jeff. Let's take a look to see how they prepare their team for this competition. been an absolute pre- pleasure and another great year. And you know what? The winner is... <laughs> 